Uh, you can both prevent and you can prepare, not fully of course, always still talking about risk and uncertainty. In terms of prevention, uh, it's all related to scenario analysis, uh, contingency planning and assessment of rare events for which uh, we've made a lot of progress. In terms of prepare, uh, there's also the whole dimension of incident management that is typically underplayed uh, in, in some, uh, some courses and also some methodology of operation risk. So this is something I would like to stress in this course is around contingency planning and incident management because experience have shown that companies have com that have come on top of large incidents are the companies that are managing them the best. Well, I'm going to disappoint you. A, I don't know. B, it depends. There is no magic bullet, of course. It really depends on the structure of your business and the culture of your company. So if I take two examples, uh, I know in terms of cyber risk, I know companies that are extremely secure on that front and some very much less so. So my guess would be look at cyber. Uh, other companies are very strict on their growth rates and very ambitious. So my top risk for them would be unsustainable growth. But for others, it's completely different. So it's really depend on the structure of your business and your priorities, plus everything that you don't know and that's coming around the corner and that nobody knows. So we're going to talk about all this.